everyone it's your girl me viva and welcome back to my channel and welcome back to yet another reaction video now i think about a week ago um i did like two reaction videos so if you check those out i really appreciate it and you can see that i am on the official the sims youtube channel once again so you know that means that there is another new trailer out so as i said last week i did a reaction video to the official reveal trailer of the new expansion pack that's coming out for the sims 4 very very soon called eco lifestyle and um uh, y'all let me know how y'all felt about the pack initially for when, when you saw it in the comment section below and i want y'all to continue to do that but today they have revealed a official gameplay trailer which i'm going to react to it just uploaded like 19 minutes ago I just woke up i wasn't expecting them to drop no trailer or anything like that so i'm about to watch this trailer and react to it for y'all today so let's go ahead and see what's going on in this trailer and see if we can learn a little bit more about this expansion pack of eco lifestyle all right y'all so i'm about to react to the trailer this is the sense for eco lifestyle official gameplay trailer and uh, i will have the link to it down in the description so you can check it out for yourselves but like here we go let's uh check it out Finally, back home in beautiful Evergreen. <laughs> Harbor? What happened to this place? Do they actually like living like this? Now, when I said, like, I like this new world that's coming with this expansion pack, I like it for some reason. Like, I like the theme of it, and I like how grungy and dirty it is when it first start off, and you have to, like, change the environment. I actually like that, y'all, like, for real. Like, look at all the trash, though. You go to university for a few years, and the whole town falls in love with trash. <laughs> okay, that's happening. Is that a new woohoo in the dumpster? Y'all see that? Y'all know I'm all about my new woohoo locations, and that definitely looks like it could be a potentially a new woohoo location as the dumpster, which is, who would do that? That's kind of nasty and gross. During a pandemic? <laughs> I'm just like, anyways, uh, I'm not so sure about that. They may be okay yep, with definitely it, new woohoo. I know we can do better. I just have to show them how. First step, reduce my eco footprint. Solar panels, wind turbines. Everything is going back so fast. I'll play it back slower. A few I ain't gonna pause no more. Off the grid. Feels better already. Now the hard part. Getting my neighbors to want a cleaner, more sustainable city too. Fortunately, my buddy Knox is a real advocate for the eco lifestyle. Rude flex, I know, but go with it. He's done some great work pushing neighborhood action plans. Like a water shutoff day. He's a little hard on you if you don't participate though. Sorry, That's interesting. Diane. Knox is campaigning to change this barren lot into a community garden. He's got big dreams of growing sustainable food, like vertical gardens that take less space to grow more, or harvesting insects for a crunchy alternative to meat. Oh, so you could eat bugs now versus meat. I'm not so sure if I'm on board with that, but okay, interesting. But it's not up to him. It's up to the people. And it looks like they voted for a community makerspace. Oh. Eh, he'll get over it. A makerspace is great. We don't have to throw away everything just because we don't want it anymore. Upcycle it. I love me some homegrown, ultra organic, fresh farm to table fizzy juice. Zoom. And these hand dipped artisan candles are selling faster than they burn. All these makers have gotten the attention of the local entrepreneur, Bess. She's asking others to invest in her next big venture. Bess works from home as a civil designer. She invents products that help move the world toward a brighter future. She recycles found objects for parts and then uses this awesome fabricator to make them. This thing is I don't know fire. why this is I so intriguing to me. Oh. Is that a new death? Look like you could possibly like drown in there. I don't, I'm not really sure. Her inventions are going to make this community a beacon of sustainability. Big changes can start small. With just a little effort, you can impact your I really world love too. this world though. I really love this world. And I can't wait to see the little northern lights. But uh, is that it? I think that might just be it. Yeah, that's just about it, y'all. So that is the official gameplay trailer and for some reason as i stated in my let's play it back a little bit um 
slower. For some reason, even though like this type of like stuff normally doesn't intrigue me for some reason I'm interested in what's going on in this expansion pack I don't know why I just am and it's just like I don't know I don't know what it is about it but I know that uh after the reveal trailer Twitter was blowing up and a lot of people weren't happy uh about this pack of course this is not a pack that we necessarily uh, wanted or asked for or they felt like uh, this tied in with um, was it Tiny Living or whatever um, I knew a lot of people were not going to be very excited about this I mean I wasn't really excited about it either. I'm still not exactly excited for it um, a lot of people felt like they shouldn't have wasted a expansion pack on this type of uh, theming for a pack they felt like maybe it could be a more like a game pack and I kind of agree with that as well but I don't know people feel like it might won't have enough content to uh, stand out to be an expansion pack but once again I I can't say that or not I like I have to full on play it for myself and determine that but I don't know I just feel like it's uh it is what it is at this point. I don't know. I'm like, I can't waste my energy being upset with what we get and just deal with what we get. A lot of the packs um, that we have for the game, I didn't care for as well. But, uh, you know, it's there. It's there. What can you do? What really can you do? It's just, hey, this pack is not for you. If you don't want it, don't get it in hope that the next one is something that you want i don't know also those little scooters i know i was like are those like used as like the bikes or whatever um like in university and i think i put it well i don't think no no i didn't i saw it but i didn't put it out there those are actual vehicles that your sims could ride on to get here and there i'm pretty sure it worked just the same as bicycles or whatever and i'm just interested in like just making stuff and selling stuff what i'm really more interested is like making stuff and having like an online business where like you get online orders so you make stuff for certain people and possibly like ship it off or whatever that's what I'm more interested in and I also I do want to see the necessary steps it takes from changing the world to like this nasty trashy grungy dirty looking place to something more beautiful naturally and trying to help the environment and stuff like that which I'm not even into I don't even know why that's the thing I don't know but y'all know I'm getting this pack let me know if y'all are going to get the pack or not in the comment section below have your mind changed from what you've seen from the reveal trailer to this actual official gameplay trailer have your maybe something in this trailer did change your mind about the pack or not now i know a lot of y'all feel like spending 40 dollars right now is not justified by this pack and i completely agree with that and i can understand and see where you're coming from with that but I don't know. Let me know, y'all. I just want to know all y'all opinions down in the comment section below. I really, really do because I like to read them and whatever. But, um, yeah, I don't know what else to say. Like I said, I'm getting it, uh, of course, because, you know, I get all the packs on it. Now, I think I'm necessarily changing my mind about starting a new Let's Play on my channel for this expansion pack. I think I'm just going to, like stream it out on twitch so follow me on twitch because my channel is about to take a different change to it to kind of like i don't know feel like i'm doing something and doing something that y'all really want and to release some stress off of me so y'all will see that when it does happen i can't tell you exactly what day it will happen but my channel will be taking a different approach very very soon so yeah like up this video if you haven't already and subscribe to my channel if you're new follow all those links down below and i will see y'all in my next video bye